This video series is based upon my book, The Dancer's Study Guide. It's available on paperback and Amazon Kindle, and you can find out more on my website, anthony-king.com. I live in the middle of nowhere. What should I do? I've taught many dance classes abroad and in small rural communities, and in some places with under 150 people in a village. However, it's important not to forget that nowadays you can learn virtually and in a variety of ways and expand your skills via, say, DVD, for example, or by learning from what you see online, on television, and also by reading books. This means that you can use your time wherever you are, wherever you are located, to become the best that you can be. Sometimes living in this type of area can actually be advantageous for you. I'll give you an example. If you're the only person interested in teaching dance, then potentially you could become the most well-known dance teacher in that whole area, and then can build your reputation that way. On the other hand, if you feel that your options are restricted by an area and you've done everything that you do to fulfill your potential in that area, then consider moving somewhere residential with more options for you. Follow your heart. And if you feel like you need to move to a new city or country to train, then do so. The experience in itself will be amazing for you as there's, there's nothing more fulfilling than following your dream and doing something that you enjoy. In fact, there's no way you can fail because failing is to not follow your dream and to live in regret. Aim to reach your full potential, firstly, where you are, and once you have done so to the best of your ability, then feel free to move to a different location to continue your evolution and growth in dance.